Well, looks are deceiving because even though the tenants are playing net, net, net leases, for me to induce, to get a tenant into empty space, I had to give them free rent. Sometimes it's six months, sometimes it's nine months, sometimes it's 10 months, 12 months. Whatever the, the tenant and how badly I want that tenant in, however I can try and get the tenant in to induce them, to get them to come into my center. It's a cost to me. So all those months that he's in there, he's not paying me any rent. He's paying me, he's paying the overheads, which is a good thing for me, so that it's not coming out of my pocket. Okay, so that's one thing. The second thing is, Mr. Tan will say, hey listen, uh, okay, I'm paying you the 20 bucks, I'm paying you the additional rent, you're giving me 10 months free rent. Uh, by the way, for me to move in the space, I need another $20 of uh, money that I want you to give me so I can fix up the space. So then the, the landlord goes in his pocket, takes out the money and gives it to the tenant. It's a great deal to be a tenant, uh, you know, especially when, when there's lots of space available. So the tenant is negotiating and he's in the space and you're going, look at all these people paying rent. Well, first of all, not everybody's paying rent at the same time because some people who are new aren't paying rent also, too, you're paying inducements. In other words, you're giving them 20 bucks a foot to move in. So, so you may not see that money back from the tenant for two years, sometimes three years. So when you go into mall and say, oh, look at these guys, they're all doing so well, full of tenancies, that, that may not be true at all. So when you get into real estate and you understand the game of retail or office leasing or any kind of leasing, that should give you a hint. Looks are deceiving. Reality is the only way to ask. Look at the rent roll, look at the expenses, look at the operating budgets, and that's how you'll know whether or not a deal is gonna make money over a period of time. Be smart. Do your due diligence.